What is this here? This colloidal substance. You, you can call it colloid. Colloid is, it contains pyroglobulin, a protein pool. From here, the amino acid tyrosine is obtained and then tyrosine is iodinated, tyrosine is called the precursor of T3 and T4. T3, triiodotyrodine, T4, thyroxine. Triiodotyrodine has three iodine atoms and T4 has four iodine atoms. And when you see the cells in between follicles, like this cell, this is a follicle here, this is another follicle, this is follicle, there are so many follicles, but in between thyroid follicles, you will see parafollicular cells. These parafollicular cells secrete another hormone called calcitonin. So, calcitonin, T3 and T4 are thyroid hormones. T3 and T4 are made by these follicular cells, but calcitonin is made by parafollicular cells. These are parafollicular cells. The cells that are located in between the follicles. You can find in your even textbook parafollicular cells. If I ask you what is the function of the cell as indicated, it produces T3, T3 and T4. What is the function of the cell as indicated? It secretes calcitonin or CT. So you have been informed about these hormones, but you are looking at, physically looking at what? Thyroid, a section through thyroid gland showing thyroid follicles. Each follicle is made of follicular cells. In between follicles are the, parafoll are the parafollicular cells. Okay, they are also called T cells. Okay, what is the signi what, what is the signature feature for thyroid gland? Thyroid follicle containing colloid. Unmistakable. So you may have to identify the gland. Like you identified in your first lab exam, you had to identify two glands. One, number one, another was number 53. Number one was parotid gland, 53 was sub. Can you see this gland? This gland is parathyroid gland. Parathyroid. Now, this is parathyroid gland. But how do you know 